Now, frost on the ground or your windshield is expected to be more common with colder temperatures ahead. Jack Wu with the 22 News Storm Team explains why frost forms. With colder temperatures on the horizon, especially in the overnight, it's going to become a regular occurrence this winter to have frost on your windshield or on your lawn. And let's take a look at how that forms. First thing, we need colder air temperatures. We're looking for at least 36 degrees or lower. That would be ideal for frost to form. As that air gets colder, it starts to sink to ground level where we need freezing ground temperatures. That's going to be 32 degrees or less. If we have both of those things, water molecules in the air touch the surface. So that's either your grass or your windshield, and that's going to result in ice crystals forming on both. Now, what are ideal conditions to look out for to know if we're, we're going to have frost the next day or not? One thing, clear skies and light winds. If we have intense winds the night of, we're not going to be able to have the water, cule, water molecule rest on the grass or your windshield long enough for it to freeze. Another thing, temperatures in the 30s. If we have 30 degree temperatures, that ground temperature is able to get to freezing and we definitely want moisture on the ground. If it's rained the night previous, then it just makes more for a catalyst to see frost on your windshield or on your grass. Working for you, I'm Jack Wu with the 22 News Storm Team.